Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Mikkel. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Turn on the bell. Each time I drop in, I upload a video. You will be notified. So turn on the bell. Ding, ding, ding. Turn on the bell. Hope everyone is, is having a day of maintaining despite the obstacles. I'm also having a day of just maintaining despite the obstacles. I appreciate all the love and support. And thanks again for tuning in with me for another video. For today's topic subject title is going to be on, it's going to be about, it's going to be titled Bad Luck. On Friday, I made a video talking about good luck. Does good luck exist? Is good luck real? Feeling lucky. Now for today, I'm going to make a video on is bad luck real? Does bad luck exist? Feeling bad luck. Yes. Just like good luck exists and is real, bad luck also exists and is real. If bad luck comes to you just out the blue, it just comes to you out of nowhere. It just comes from out of left field and it just, it comes as a complete shock. It just blows up in your face. It just hits you. Bad luck just hits you and can crash it down on you. You don't know that it's coming. You don't see it coming. It's like, but well, sometimes you get a bad feeling. Some people just got that feeling that something bad is going to happen. It's a saying that goes like, Something's got to go wrong because I'm feeling way too good. Something got to go wrong because I'm feeling way too damn good. I've, I've heard people say something got to happen because it's like things is going too good. It's like it's too good to be true how good things is going. So something bad got to happen. Something's got to happen. Some people get that feeling that something bad do happen. You're not jinxing yourself, but it's just, it's your instincts. It's your gut feeling. It's, it's the inner feeling. It's the inner voice. It's where you feel like something bad, terrible is going to happen and it come true. It's your intuition. Your intuition, your third eye, and your instincts let you right. It was telling you right. It was giving you the right feeling. Because you felt it. You felt it. Something horrible happened. You felt it. And something horrible happened we can't we can't stop bad luck from coming to us just like we can't make good luck come to us we cannot make good luck come to us so we can't stop bad luck from coming to us, from pouring down on our lives. Because bad luck and good luck is both out of our control. Bad luck is out of our control. It's out of our reach. We can't control it. We can't stop it. We can't maintain it. We can't slow it down. 
We can't rush it away. We can't make it go in speed mode. <laughs> we can't speed it away. It got to take its own course. That's with bad luck and good luck. They both got to take their own course. Bad luck has to take its own course. It got to stop and go away in its own time. It got to stop when the creator wants it to stop and leave you. It got to stop when the universe wants it to stop. It got to stop when the creator and the universe want to remove it out of your life. It got to stop when the creator and the universe want to remove it out of your life. Yeah, so a lot of times when we get bad luck, when it's like life is constantly beating us down, life is dragging us down, life is tearing and ripping us apart, life is ripping us to shreds and, and breaking us into pieces. It's like life just keep, it's like life is hitting us from all angles. It's like life and bad luck is hitting us from all angles, all directions, all areas, all sides. And it's like, we get bad luck with our finances. Our finances, we might, we might be in poverty. We keep staying in poverty. We keep struggling with money, with finances. We can't save no money. It's like money always leaves our hand. As soon as money gets into our hands, it leaves our hands very quickly. It's like we can't get on our feet. We just stay down. It's one thing after another. It's like it's it's like a constant hit and a jab at you. After another, behind each other, back to back, over and over. It's like we got bad luck with finding a partner, a spouse, a lover, a husband, a wife, a girlfriend, a boyfriend. We have a hard time and bad luck finding a special person, our true soulmate. We have a hard time getting a job. We have a hard time getting a good job, a high paying job. Sometimes we might struggle with mental illness, depression. It might become hard to shake off depression mental illness, anxiety, stress, all that stuff. Bipolar disorder, manic, depressive disorder, psychosis, neurotic, borderline, personality disorder, disassociative identity disorder. That might come at you. Mental illness might come at you and that might be a hard battle. Bad luck might strike you with mental illness. Bad luck might strike you with having a a chemical imbalance in your brain. Bad luck might strike you with having a chemical imbalance in your brain, which causes mental issues, mental illnesses, mental disorders. It causes psychological problems. 
It causes mental and psychological disadvantages. And that, and that limit you from being stable mentally. It limits your mental stability. And it makes you cannot function, think properly right. You can't function properly right. You can't live right. You can't take care of yourself well. You can't handle your business good. You can't handle everyday life skills good. Mental illness makes your living skills bad. That's, that's bad luck. I said bad luck attack from all angles. Bad luck can attack your mental state, your well-being, your psychological well-being. It can attack you from having, it can attack you in your career with not getting a good job, a good high-paying job, a good high-paying position, and it can attack your finances. It can take away your vehicle. It might make your vehicle break down, stop working, stop running, and you can't afford to get another vehicle at the moment because you're struggling with finances. You're struggling with money. You're trying to pay bills, trying to make ends meet, trying to keep a roof over your head. You're struggling with trying to keep a roof over your head and you're struggling with trying to just make ends meet, trying to make ends meet to pay your bills and to keep food on your table and to get to keep the basic necessities and toiletes and basic needs that you need. Basic needs for living, for survival. Bad luck just keep attacking you, and it's like you is, you're trying to stay in survival mode. You're trying to be a survivor. It's like survivor of the fittest. It's like survivor of the fittest. It's like survivor of the fittest. You're trying to survive. You're trying to be a survivor. You're just in survival mode. You're trying to stay afloat and trying to make it, maintain and sustain yourself with living, with the daily living skills. You're trying to maintain and sustain yourself with daily living skills to survive, thrive, and make it in this world, in society, on this earth, on this matrix, in the simulation, on this realm that we live on. Yes, yeah, so, like I say, bad luck is out of your patrol and only the creator, the most high of the universe, and the universe can take that bad luck off you. Only the most high creator of the universe, the universe, only that can take the bad luck off of you. You can work hard and try to manage your bad luck so that it's not too bad or not too overwhelming or not bring you down and keep you down so much. You can try to work hard so so bad luck don't keep you down too bad and too much. But overall, it's going to take a higher power, a higher authority to get this bad luck offer you and that's the creator and the universe it's going to take higher power and higher authorities to remove 
and take away and take away all the bad luck off of you. It's his higher power, higher authority to take all the bad luck and to take the bad luck off of you. It's gonna take it's gonna take a higher power, a like higher power was to take the rainy days, to take the rainy and cloudy days out your life and bring in the bright sunshine like and sunny days in your life. So all so all you can do is hope for the best. It's out of your control. It's out of your reach. You can't control it. So all you can do is just hope for the best. Just hope the creator and the universe will help you. Will come to your rescue to get that bad luck out of your life and to bring some good luck in your life. Let the bad luck wash away and flow out your life. And let the good luck wash in and flow into your life, in your life. That's all you can do. But if you, if, but if bad luck don't go away, then you got to accept your fate. If bad luck is lingering, for years upon years. If bad luck is lingering for years upon years, then you got to accept that maybe that's your fate. You got to accept that that is your fate. That's your destiny. That's your life path. That's your lifeline. That's in your star alignment. That's in your stars. That's in your lucky stars. Apparently, you got a lot of bad luck in your lucky stars. Well, well apparently, I should say your bad stars because it's bad luck. So apparently, that's in your that's in your bad stars. That's in the stars for your life. That's in the stars. For you, that's that's in your life course. It was decided ahead of time that that would be your purpose. It was decided ahead of time that that would be your purpose. That's your life. That's your that's your purpose of being on this earth. That's your mission and purpose of being on this earth. That's the life that you was chose to live out in this world. That's the life that you was chose to live out in this world, on this world. That's your soul. That's your purpose, your mission. That's your destiny, and that is your fate. It's hard to accept, but you gotta come to, to grips and the terms with it and just accept it. I know it's a hard pill to swallow, but you have to learn to accept it and try to live the best way that you can try to make life work the best for you that you can accept it and just try to make life work the best way that you can and accept it try to just have accept it try to just have as much accept it and try to find and have as much happiness as you can and try to just live a happy and fulfilling life. 
the best way you can and as much as you can. I appreciate all the love and support. Thanks again for tuning in with me for another video. We'll see you all again in my next video. Enjoy the rest of your day of just maintaining despite the obstacles. I'm also going to enjoy the rest of my day of maintaining despite the obstacles. I love to the chosen ones that's out there. I love you all I truly and sincerely mean that from the bottom of my heart. My chosen ones, bye. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Turn on the bell. You see my drop in, upload a video. You will be notified. So turn on the bell. Ding, ding, ding. Turn on the bell. This is your girl, Mikhail, the world goddess. This is your girl, Mikhail. Sign it out. I'm out. Until next time, I'll see you. One love. Whole love. I'm out. For love.